Hey, hello, everybody. I am Slashem VC. This is Vulture for Slashem. What is Slashem? Slashem is an extent, is a fork of NetHack. Let's see, fork. They call it a fork, they call it something else. Oh, a variant. And in this variant, we are following the continuing adventures of Nygrath Zugu, the Eliminator, an experience level 5 on dungeon level 6, Undead Slayer. In the last episode, we made our way through the mines. And in this episode, we're going to check out the mine shop. Um, and the very last thing that we did was shoot a dwarf thief with our pistol, which was really quite fun. I'm going to switch back to barehanded combat. Put the dwarf to sleep. And continue to look for the shop. Uh, but you guys will have... Oh, a monkey. I think... Oh, he stole all five brigs of Wolfsbane. That is crazy. I thought he could only steal one at a time. He can steal a whole stack. Shall we eat the monkey? And there's another monkey. He tried to steal my armor, but gave up. I put him to sleep. Ugh, here comes a wizard. I need to put him to sleep. What did he do? Curse me with uh, hunger or something? Gnomish wizard zaps a zinc wand. The gnomish wizard has made a hole in the ground. The gnomish wizard falls through, and yet he's still standing here. Is th That's a little weird. Um, hmm. I'm curious about that. That could be a bug. Let me fire off a message about that real quick. Okay, that uh, could have been a bug. Might not have been. I'm not sure. Let's eat that monkey. I finish eating the monkey corpse, and I'm beginning to feel hungry. Hmm. And another time that I feel like something weird has happened. Um, let's um, eat something else. See what happens. Okay, good. That worked. All right, we finally made it onto the shop level, it seems. Another monkey, eh? How many monkeys are there going to be on this level? Still wielding with our bare hands. So unfair to put these to sleep with one hit. He had a food ration on him. Ah, uh, don't tell me it's an abandoned shop. Oh, the possibility of getting a wish is real. Not with that lamp, though. How about with this one? Probably not. Hey, dude, you got any magic lamps in here? No? 13, 13, and 9? What? 13, 13, and 10. Why are they different prices? Brass lantern. Feeling hungry again. <laughs> Boy, food is an issue, huh? Oh, it's this check. His lighting shop. How many candles? Five candles. Wow, we're going to be two candles short. Let me out of here, Shaq. A little garter snake action in the hallway for you. I believe, other than the lighting shop, that this is uh, an abandoned shopping place. It is. All the shops are abandoned except for... Ooh, now that shop looks empty, but I'll bet you that the shopkeeper is in there and... Oh, there he is. I was going to say that he, he was invisible. Hardware store. He has a bag for sale. A hardware store with scrolls and a potion. 
No, 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 no. It's a general store. I read it wrong. Okay. Well, how much for the bag? Two Zork meds. Okay. Well, at least it'll do the job that it needs to do, which is keep my scrolls from being blanked and my potions from exploding. Any identifies? That's not an identify scroll. That's an unlabeled scroll. Uh, I thought I bought the bag already, but all right, go ahead. Let me out of here. All right, let's see if we can find the... Uh... There it is. Hey, nice, a co-aligned altar. That's good news. And we do have a wand of create monster, so we can take advantage of this situation a little bit. Let's uh, close the door and keep the dog out that he doesn't eat any corpses we might want to try sacrificing. I don't think this is a pretty apropos thing. We're going to sacrifice a sheep. Yep, that'll be our first sacrifice. Sacrifice is consumed in a burst of flame. And another sheep. Excuse me. Who's the, what's this priest's name? Peaceful priest of Seth. He doesn't have a name. You feel partially absolved. I guess that's because we prayed earlier. Oh, that's good. Maybe we can pray again later. Use our wooden stake to kill this acid blob. And we're hungry again. I don't know why we stay hungry all the time. Remove our weapon. Resume sacrificing. Oh, yeah, so speaking of, you know, changes from Slash into NetHack, there are a variety of new sacrifice gifts and unique artifacts also, obviously. Wouldn't there be? I mean, of course you'd expect that. Okay, floor leaf clover at our feet means our luck has improved a bit. Glad this wand had a bunch of charges. Sometimes you get them and they just have a few. You feel partially absolved. Hmm. I wonder if the undead slayer is not supposed to kill peaceful monsters or something. I thought Chaotix could do it without penalty, but... Every time I kill something peaceful, it's acting like I need to be absolved afterwards. That would be something to look up if the wiki has any info on it. Oh, nice. A light. That's all I need. And the wax golem's not going to leave a corpse. But he may leave some candles. Do they leave candles? I think they do. Come on, Golem. Your time has... Hey! Who opened the door? Well, we'll have to chase him down later. Talk about chasing a cat around the room. Okay. Ooh. Old dragon. Got baby corpse. I've got a good feeling. No, just a four leaf clover. And we're hungry again. If 
finally have exhausted the Wand of Great Monsters powers. And we never did get a sacrifice gift. But oh well. Yikes. What was destroyed? I destroyed the Wax Golem. Did he burn up any of my stuff? Mm, no. Good. How many candles did he drop? Uh, plenty. I think I'll go sell everything back to Ishak except the seven that I need to win the game. Both my dogs have leveled up at this time. Yeah, I think we'll just, uh... That's interesting, the way the, the, way the level's laid out. I guess the staircase down is going to be over here somewhere. Although, I don't believe we're ready to go down into the bottom of the mines with this character. Ooh, unicorn. Ooh, 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 ooh. Wonder. Is my dog going to be able to handle that? Be good. Be good. Yes. Well done, doggy. We have a unicorn horn now. Go see Mr. Ishak again. Hello, sir. I have some candles for sale. Eighteen of them, is to be exact. These are either blessed or cursed. <laughs> Guess we'll hold on to them. I hope they're not cursed. Oh, speaking of that. Uh, no, before we sell those, let's go check. I forgot that's what we were looking for the altar for to begin with, was to check Bless Curse on everything. Oh. There we go. So, Uncursed Wolfsbane, Blessed Scroll, Uncursed Potions, Uncursed, those are Blessed Candles. Cool. We'll keep them. Bag is uncursed. Okay. Very good. Mm, we just really put on the armor without checking, didn't we? Okay. Hopefully we'll find an altar in the regular dungeon. We sold those. Okay, good. And I think we're going to go back into the regular dungeon branch now. Um, Flashem is considerably difficult enough. That uh, with this character, no, there's no way we would survive lower levels of mines. Although, the most dangerous thing down there is often the vampires, and we should be intrinsically drain resistant. I'm waiting for my other dog. Come on, dog. Let's go. But, I'm an undead slayer. I must kill the cobbled zombie before we proceed. There we go. All right, should we explore this level a bit? Might be some interesting stuff on it. Maybe a magic lamp, a gray stone, something cool. Ooh, brown mold, passive attack. Boom. Boom. Okay, I'm not going to get killed by a brown mold. No, sir. What's this? Level teleporter. That might be a quick way to get out of the dungeon. We're on five. I doubt it would send us downward. Let's go see. Try level porting. And it did send us down. I'll be darned. We're now one or two levels below. <laughs> Shop. We better start looking for the up staircase. I really thought that would send us straight up. There's the up staircase. Hey, all right. You feel more confident in your fighting skills. Barehanded combat. Uh, we are now more skilled. Matter of fact, how skilled are we? Skilled. We already had basic, so we've reached skilled in that. Excellent. We started with basic and dagger and 
pistol? Oh, pistol is a skill now. Apparently we can cast protection, body spells, and matter spells. And level up and whip. I'm looking for the... Um, weapon we started with here, but I don't see it on the list. Anyway, time for me to wrap this up. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.